Hey kids, we're gonna make this brief. Today we have a 2002 Ford Windstar. Um, they all had the 3.8, and uh, at least in America. We, are pull we pulled the AC compressor. That's the old junk one. Um, clutch is bad in it, and whatever. Anyway, this is a non-working AC system. Before I started, it'll be a non-working when I'm done. We're, right now we're just swapping in a junkyard unit that's just to give it a pulley because you cannot bypass the factory pulley because, well, this uh, water neck right here off the water pump. Um, otherwise, it'd be nice to just buy a shorter belt and bypass it. Anyway, tools needed to do the job. 15 millimeter. Uh, that was for your uh, idler pulley. Uh, I used a ratcheting 13, but you could do it with a regular 13 if you want. I like the ratcheting shit because it just speeds things up so much. A ratcheting 10 millimeter. Um, a, supposed to be an 8 millimeter, but I used a 5 16 for the ground right here on the uh, upper radiator core support. I used a regular uh, 10 millimeter socket, a short 13, a deep well 13, and I believe. I may have actually used this one uh, uh, one inch 3 8 drive extension at some point. I did 99% of the work with this. I used this just for like a little quick, the very last bolt, just because there was just more swing room. You could probably do it with either one. This is a Michigan car, so it's fucking rusty as shit. Um, Idler pulley was a 15. I basically had to leave it in there for a really long time, even though the bolt was completely out until this bracket was out of the loosened this bracket is held in place by like one two three ten millimeters i believe two ten millimeter bolt or head bolts or uh, bolt heads so anyway uh, i'm talking about the fasteners it's tool size not the actual uh, thread pitch uh, there are three main bolts holding on the AC compressor bracket. I left the, or I mean the alternator bracket. I left the alternator on. You can take that off and maybe make it easier for yourself. I don't know. Um, the AC compressor itself is held on by a number four fasteners. They each have a 10 millimeter head. This is where the 10 millimeter ratcheting wrench came in really fucking handy. You can take the top two out completely. The bottom two have to remain in the AC compressor. So when you go to put the new compressor in, slide the two bolts in there, work the compressor into place, and uh, start threading those in. And there. Uh, the line, both lines are held in by one single 10 millimeter uh, bolt right here. Ratcheting uh, 10 millimeter, did it uh, in a matter of seconds, and we were done. Now, I also chose to remove the lines up here to swing the main line over. That was why I ended up undoing this little ground cable right here. Um, so, if you take off that ground cable, it allows you to swing that out of your way, it gives you a lot more room to work. Um, his AC system was totally fucked. He's got, you know, big old split busted open there, and it's just junk. But it's like 300,000 miles on this fucking thing, so he doesn't give a shit. He just, we, we just need to go in. So I hope somebody learned something today. Um, that what, what you need to do and what you don't need to do. You need to have this AC bracket out. You will not get it out without having it out. You just, maybe if you pull the radiator forward, you might be able to squeeze it out, but I don't think you can. Um, didn't try. Uh, this is the faster way. The tensioner is way in the back, and you need to put a 13 wrench. Oh, that's something I forgot to mention on here. Uh, 13 millimeter wrench on the idler pulley, or I mean the tensioner pulley, and you pull it back. Now I use two wrenches. I use this 15 on the 13 wrench and uh, popped it off. It's kind of a hassle to do by yourself. Um, I almost got it. I had a real pain, and then in the end, I just grabbed the belt from the top and just yanked it off the alternator pulley. To put it on, it's really helpful to have a second person where one person's down below, loosens up the tension, or, you know, releases the tension. Somebody else slips the belt on. Two people, helpful. Peace out, bitches. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm up in the D again. Beautiful day. Ain't no fucking leaves here, though. Shit.